the day I was born was the day the world collapsed. Those that survived had to make new lives underground. Up above, there was nothing but ash and cold and death. People thought it would last forever, but without us up there, life returned. I was six years old the first time I saw the sun. Mom and Dad were heartbroken by what they saw. The world they'd known gone forever. But not me. I'd never seen anything so perfect. We weren't the only ones who'd survived, and slowly but surely, our little community grew. It wasn't always easy, but for a time, there was peace and prosperity. A new home, a new life, a new normal. But, like all things in this world, it was too good to last. The highwaymen came from the east, led by a pair of sisters, twins. Said they'd heard about our little paradise. Said they wanted it for themselves. We never stood a chance. They took everything from us, our food, our homes, our people. We needed a miracle. And that's when we heard the name Thomas Rush. He and his captain had been up and down the West Coast helping folks like us rebuild. And they were on a train headed right through Hope County. Mom sent me to find them, convince them to help us take our home back. They were our last hope, our salvation. But it all went horribly wrong. Captain, you're alive! Jesus! They're heading this way! Get off, Captain! Come on, get up! What's the fucking highwaymen? They're gonna kill us! Get up, Captain, get up! Jesus, Barnes, keep screaming like that, you're gonna bring them all down on us. Rush, you're alive! Help me! No, we have no time, we gotta go! Barnes? We are not leaving the cabin behind. They're coming fast. We need to stick together. Understood? Cap. Your time to shine. We need to get armed. We need to get our people. And we need you to find a way out of here. I know. Yeah, easier said than done. One step at a time, Barnes. You lead, we'll follow.
trouble if we get caught in that tool. We need to keep moving. I knew coming to Hope County was a bad idea. Stay close, Florence. Right. Hang in there. Stay together. Fuck out. your stupid train! <laughs> Fuck you! You suck! Captain! Eat my ass! The usual stuff in all this wreck. Keep an eye out. See if you can string something useful together. This is very dangerous. I will move. Better find the armory wagon and get better weapons. Don't be foolish. We need to run. Let's keep moving. We gotta save these people. The sooner we find them, my god. The highwaymen are everywhere. I really think we should get out of here. Stay calm. Gotta keep going. There's gotta be more. everybody. Santa delivered a whole damn train full of presents. Uh, what do we have here? Rabbit. Ooh. I gotta ask you rabbits a question. The fuck you think was gonna happen? Riding in on a giant hunk of iron, just clouds of black smoke. You think we would've noticed? What do you want, Barnes? We wanna know. If your problem solvers, a problem makers. What? Uh, our pops always told us that people either solve problems or make problems. The world's got too many fucking problems. And we're looking for people to help solve problems. Uh, our problems. If you're a problem solver, we got you covered. Food, clothes, guns. Anything you need. <laughs> Even health insurance. <laughs> but if you make problems well, Pops taught us what to do with problem makers. Problem makers need to be solved. Mm -hmm. Old man solved a shit ton of problems in his day. Yeah. Hell yeah. So, rabbits. Are you all problem solvers or problem makers? 
We solve problems. We've been solving problems all over this country. Barnes. We can give you fresh water, build shelters. We can get you anything you need. Barnes, shut up! You can build all that? Well... I'm... not me. But Rush here... Well, then you... are gonna be our number one problem solver. Go fuck yourself. Huh. Okay. <laughs> You done? So, let's try this again. You gonna help solve problems for us, Mr. Rush? Okay. Save yourself. Oh, no. Wake up, wake up. I recognize you from the train. You're captain of security, right? I'm Carmina. Oh my god, I saw you hit the water and I was able to pull you out before you drowned, but... Near as I can tell, I think we're the only ones who got away. Come on. Okay. We have to be careful. The twins... They took off with Rush, but a lot of the highwaymen, they stuck around. Okay, we... we have to get back to Hope County. My mom. My mom. She'll know what to do. Come on. Mister. Come on. We just need to follow the river to get to Hope County. I can't believe what happened. They must have seen the train coming. I should have known better. Those fucking twins, Mickey and Lou. The first time I saw them was when they came to our house. Said it was their house now. And we could either leave willingly or they'd burn it down with us inside. My dad tried to fight. So, they took him. Then they took the house. My mom and I were forced to start over on our own. We weren't their only victims. But my mom managed to bring survivors together and we all tried to build a place where we'd be safe. There's a tunnel up there that leads to Hope County. The highwaymen are blocking our way in. We're gonna need some firepower. Let's keep moving.
that old nine when I left to get help. There's a workbench inside. You can use it to build a weapon. Rush was supposed to be the final piece so that we could finally fight back. But now, we're worse off than we were before. I'm sorry about your people. I promise I'll figure out a way to make this right. Resourceful, so let's build something. You can use benches like this to build makeshift weapons and refill in. Yeah, we need more resources. We're gonna have to poke around and scare some up. Come on, we're almost there. There it is. Home. I hope Mom is okay. Mina! Oh, thank God. I was so worried. Mom. Uh, kids, go back inside. I'll be right there. What's wrong? There is a whole train full of people to help us. But... The highwaymen? The twins? They took Rush. Everyone else was killed. Oh, my God. It was terrible. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I never should have gone out there, Mom. I... Oh, honey. What are we gonna do now? I, I don't know. I, I, I don't know. I mean, no one's coming to help us. We're on our own. It's just us. Shh. Let's get you both inside. You can tell me the whole story. Thank you for bringing her home.
All right, guys. You know how to handle a gun. You know your way around this valley better than anybody. So? So? Sitting around moping isn't doing any good. Look, Rush was supposed to help us build someplace safe. Now, it's up to us. There are brave people here scattered around. We just have to find them. Bring everyone together. Show them we can stand up to the highwaymen. Mom, it's not gonna be easy. I know. But it's our only choice. Have you got a minute? So, this is it. Home. Mom's right. The two of us can work together to build this place back up. Any time you need a hand, give me a call. I'll come fight by your side, Cap. You don't mind if I call you Cap, right? Captain of security just sounds, well, a little formal. Listen, you have been put through the ringer. If you want to freshen up with a change of clothes before we get started, there's some stuff over there. You should probably talk to Mom. She'll give you the rundown on what we can do for Prosperity. Whatever else happens, I'm glad Carmina made it back. The people that didn't go through the collapse just don't understand. Hello. Hi, sir. I've got some things to tell you. I joined those masked freaks in a heartbeat, but they're just so cruel. My name is Kim. I guess you could say I run things around here. I know you've already been through a lot, Captain. But the truth is, we need all the help we can get. And at the moment, you're it. We thought your people on that train were gonna give us an edge. We were all gonna work together to grow things, make things. We were gonna fight back against the twins. But all of that is gone now. So, it's up to us. We've got a lot of work to do. Let me show you how things work around here. This is Prosperity. If we're gonna have a fighting chance against the Highwaymen, the first thing we've got to do is get this place up and running. We have several facilities to make Prosperity thrive. These are the places where you can craft weapons and vehicles, cultivate plants for health, and many other things. Working my ass off here, but if you... This is Hope County. In order to get the most out of our facilities, we need ethanol to upgrade them. Your map shows the highwaymen outposts, where they store the ethanol they stole from us. Secure these locations to get what we need. And here's where you can find specialists. People with the expertise to really give us a fighting chance against the twins. Bring them home, and they'll make prosperity and you stronger. But without Thomas Rush, none of this is gonna work. He's built up settlements before, and without his knowledge, we won't be able to take Prosperity to the next level. Lately, the twins are sending a lot of prisoners to the coal mine. I'd start looking there. So, that's it. We rescue Rush, find people who can run the facilities, and bring them enough ethanol to maximize what we can craft. 
If you can help us, we'll do everything we can to help you. Oh. Hope you're feeling you're okay. The, uh, the train, huh? Hi there, mister. Hello. Who's there? I can't believe you made it out of that crash. So you come in with Carmina. Hi. Hey there. No. People say New Eden's in a state of disarray ever since Joseph Seed's disappearance. Happy you made it. Some say he's dead. Some say he's up in the north beyond the mist. The only thing that's certain is he's gone. And the survivors sure prefer it that oh. way. You're the captain from the train, huh? I heard about what happened. Sorry about your people, Captain. At least you ended up in the best place Hope County has to offer. Trust me, I've seen the rest. Me? I'm Roger, Prosperity's personal pilot. Seriously, anytime you need a lift back to Prosperity, you can count on me. It's the least I can do for you, my friend. And, uh, if you want a little, uh, extra, I can see to that, too. I used to rip off five women's strongholds all over the country. Scored some really cool stuff. But ever since those Collies, the twins, showed up, excuse my language, it's impossible to gather enough ethanol to fly outside of Hope County. Hey, I tell you what. If you can find me the fuel I need, we'll go rip off highwaymen together. It won't be easy, but trust me, it's worth the risk. Get me that ethanol, and you'll see what I'm talking about. Without people, we'll never be able to make this place strong. We need to find them. My parents always talked about something called the resistance. I want to live up to that. I can't wait to give the highwaymen a big fuck you, and for that message to echo across the country for the rest of them to hear. I need a runner. My knees are just no good. Oh, thank goodness. You're so nice. I'm Bean, creator of Wikipedia. You know, your one-stop shop for maps and intel. Wikibenia, just the tips. But here's the rub. Wikibenia's in danger. My key assets are all gone. Intel, maps, you name it. 
now my business plan is missing too. But, but I, I know who gave me the shaft. My employee, Richard. He's got a real bad gambling habit, always playing crazy eights with those highwaymen and losing his pants. He must have hidden the plan somewhere for safekeeping, else they'd just take it from him. They're not very nice, or respectful. His usual gambling place isn't far from here. If you spook him, he'll run and lead you right to his hidey hole. I'm sure of it. I'd go, but I've got bad knees. <laughs> and lungs. A and eyes. Anyway, please get my business plan back. If you reach around my back now, I'll reach around yours later. That's a Wikibenia promise. Everybody who comes to prosperity helps me get better. Not dying. Not yet. That was it for me. What a shot! Hey, Cap. Finding the highway men is no walk in the park. If you ever find yourself outgunned, you can craft better weapons with the resources you find in Hope County. And remember, the folks in Prosperity are here to help in any way they can. We won't let you down.
There's reports the highwaymen have got people stealing goods off of corpses. These guys are chicken shits, and they'll run at the first sign of trouble. If you see any, take them out and loot their backpacks. We'll be full of things you can use. On your toes, enemy ahead. I can't stay here, moving. They won't know what hit them. I'm out of here! I need help! Please, someone help! Okay, yes. I lost my clothes in a game of cards. Ha ha ha. I have a problem, all right? I didn't mean for things to get this bad. I was one of Bean's scouts, and I thought that since the highwaymen travel so much, they'd be a good source of information. They said they'd play me for it, and before I knew it, I'd gambled away all of Bean's assets. The only things I had left to offer were the clothes off my back and Bean's business plan. The plan's in my secret stash in a little bunker just over the hill there. I promise, I'll never gamble again. Oh, Chris, please help me!
Oh gosh, is that how my voice sounds? Over. <laughs> Wait, no, not, not over. I wanted to tell you I had to relocate, but by my estimate, I'm closer to where you ought to be. Head, um, south, I think? You'll find me. I know you will. You know, my parents are always talking shit about the evening effort. Basically. <laughs> I'd clap for joy, but my daddy always said that was for clowns and babies, and I'm neither. Remember I mentioned the reach around your back? Well, I'm gonna set up Wikibenia HQ in prosperity starting now. I got scouts collecting hot tips, and I'll get maps again. And, well, you'll see. With my business plan, Wikibenia will go global. Just like daddy always talked about how it was before. Everyone will help us and give us donations. It'll be great. I'll see you at Prosperity soon, right? Right. I can't wait. Well, have a nice time until then. build prosperity up, the better chance we'll have at surviving this whole thing. I won't rest until we run those masked assholes out of Hope County.
sweating from that to the roots. Nice to have a place like prosperity to call home. That was it for me. I never have many friends growing up, so I got used to talking to myself out loud. Hey, this... hey, this is a... Yo, dude, you got, like, springy gams? Good legs? Oh my god, my dude, I am in, like, the worst real-life come-down that's ever graced the freaking planet right now. I grow these, uh, herbs. You know, herbs. Don't ask me what kind, it's the kind that work, okay? That kind. I trek around here with a field kit and, uh, <laughs> it fell. It fell? 
just over the lip of this weird pavement hole. It's got, like, a year's worth of homegrown stuff in there. That kit saved me from, like, eight deficiencies and four infections in the past six months alone. I can recultivate this stuff, sure, but, like, honestly, between you and me, my dude, that shit down there's my freaking lifeline. I won't last till the next harvest, next month without it. People die from, like, the dumbest shit these days. Get me my kit, and I'll keep you and your people ticking. So you can die from violence, like your god intended. Instead of, like, stepping on a nail. Hey, don't have all the fun without me. If it grows in the ground, it's good for you. Who know better? You or me? Shut up. It's me. I know better.
again. Twist some knobs or jiggle some doohickeys to build up the pressure.
yours, my guy. I almost lost it. Oh, my sweet baby Spunk. We got it back. Oh, ho, ho. this will make life so much easier. Now I can itch my bug bites and get them infected without dropping dead a month later. Thank you, for real. I've been meaning to, like, help people instead of collecting roots like a dirt hoarder and junk, so you mind if I run with you? I can set up my lab in your home camp garden or whatever, and I can help you boost your immune systems and get you feeling real good. A constitution and junk. I'll just set up my stuff there now, yeah? Yeah, I'm going now. Gonna settle in. Thanks again, my dude. Sometimes I wish I'd died on that train. It beats the pain of feeling responsible for so many deaths, you know? I thought I was helping. I thought I was giving us all a chance, but... I guess I'm just a fool. Grace Armstrong. The highwaymen took my weapon prototype and now they've got me cornered. Can't let them have that thing. I need help. Anybody. <laughs> <laughs> 